does not it's not it doesn't make any sense wonder beer wonder yeah. is just a play on words that's where the channel came from the name um so yeah so we're still looking through um the tesco range the new okay. tesco range wonder um yeah. been through i mean we've had ecat which mm -hmm. was superb um we're going to look at some of the the new lidl's range but i think i'm going to give most of them a miss yeah. for the fact that you can't get the fucking things anymore right, so okay. i think we're gonna we're gonna skip them me and you have had the mocha chocker blocker blocker um it's too stout, strong for me. which was, oh, you really liked it. Did I? This I one. That? What one? Oh yeah, yeah, that's the one. Yeah, because it's got Re low and really, really nice. Um, in some volume, of, isn't it? Some of them were a bit. Some of them were decent. Some of them were, were awful. We have got one of the um, the littles to go through, um, which I saw Dean's done. Uh, right. But we'll get around to that. This one, Wanda, is a collab. Yeah. Um, between Magic Rock okay. out of Huddersfield and um, Salt, right. um, who are out of Shipley. So they're both from Yorkshire. Okay. Um, obviously, Salt did the ECAT, mm -hmm. which is on my board. Yeah. Um, because I think ECAT is, um, is superb. Um, this one, my friend and your friend, yeah. uh, Mark, the beer hooligan, mm -hmm. rates equally with ECAT as the best of the new range. Oh, okay. Um, so I've seen, I've seen Mark's one. review of this. Um, yeah. So I'm interested. Have at you this, had this yet? Um, no. Okay. Um, Double at, dry hop? At this, yes, yeah, so yeah, we'll get to that in a second. So this one, um, at this point, it's customary to shit all over Magic Rock. As a, not a craft beer thing anymore because they sold out to the big corporation. Right. Blah, 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 blah. Don't care as long as they make decent beer. Yeah. Okay. So this one, what, what's it called, Wanda? Right times. Right times. Right times. And it's uh, what it's is it? It's a very right time at the moment. And what is it? What? what is it? It's a double dry hot. Yeah. Nipa. Yeah, New England IPA. Is that what it stands for? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. <laughs> no idea. New England IPA. Yeah, so double dry hop New England IPA. And it's six point five percent. Six point five percent on the no, old ABV but factor. More for me. Probably in your ball in your ballpark. Yeah. It says pour carefully. Pour carefully. Right. It doesn't say what's really like flavour-wise what it's got in it. Okay, so being, being it's not really giving much away. Being a New England IPA, I'm expecting it to be juicy. I'm not expecting it to be particularly um, um, bitter, um, okay. hazy, creamy. That's yep. what we're looking for for a New England IPA. Crack it um, open I then. did laugh. I did read something somewhere. Mm. Oh no, I didn't laugh. It says pour carefully may contain sediment, so I'm expecting it to be That's um, what I was reading. Yeah, um, can conditioned. So we might have a few floaters in it. Oh. Okay, I'm oh, sorry, this is how I showed you the can. <laughs> Looks really, uh, it's the, psych the psychedelia of um, the Magic Rock um, uh, cans I really like as well. I can't see no floaty bits yet. Generally they're at the bottom. Okay. So we'll, um, we'll have a look in a minute. It's got a three finger 93 head. finger head wonder. <laughs> <laughs> So, in the glass, it's quite hazy. Looks really nice. So, so uh, yeah. So, as a New England IPA, it's going to be hazy, mm -hmm. creamy, yeah. and juicy. And it, obviously, from appearance alone, yeah. we're in the right ballpark. Oh, that's good. Okay. Then. So you have a sniff. Let's we'll see what you get. Be more, be more um, enthusiastic this week. Well, you talk mostly. You don't give me a chance in edgeways. Not overly powering in smell. Okay. For a six point five percent anyway. Yeah. It's like tropical smell. Okay. Cool. Let's see what tropical fruit. So obviously we've done a bit bit of a bit shamone about the new um what was it called? The the um 
the Northern Monk smoothie, where all the flavours come from the purees. Yeah. I don't like yeah. that. I want it to come from the hops. There is in this one. No. So it's, it's not looking like it. Doesn't it doesn't smell like it. It doesn't look like that smoothie one anyway. So it smells really tro nice and tropical. Got pineapple, peach. Mm, it's quite tropical fruits, isn't it? The grapefruit smells really, really nice. You are it's getting. Grapefruit you are, smell, like. The grapefruit. I've never had grapefruit. You've never had grapefruit. No. Have you not really? No. So I'm not being funny. Like my, my, uh, uh, but probably. Probably ninety percent of the beers that we've been through on this channel yeah, are IPA, are IPA, but a lot of them, mm. that the bitterness can come from that sharpness from the from the grapefruit. Yeah. Go it's on, really fruity, doesn't it? It does smell really nice. I think on aroma alone, I think Ecat smells better than that. There's a bit of bitterness. Okay. Not a lot. Yep but I can handle that. It's a low level of bitterness, so it's probably low in IBUs, but it has got something in it. Of course it's got something in it. <laughs> yeah, it's quite, yeah. It's nice. Nice. Mm. Nice. Yeah, I think you're, I yeah. don't know, it might be too bland for you. See, I, I, I really liked ECAT because it was juicy, and well, that's yeah. where I want a New England IEPA to be. I don't know, at, at the back of your tongue, it's got like kind of. A prickle, prickly. Yeah. So that's where so you, the, the hops. hops. Yeah, see, so you're getting there. You're getting there, people. You should get in there. Yeah, I was reading that up there earlier. Was you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so that's the brew dog thing. Yeah, the brew dog tasting session. Oh, that's what hilarious. To, I, I didn't read it before, so I read it earlier and I remember it. <laughs> It comes from the hops because I was reading it. And so the hops, thought, are, oh, yeah. the hops are like the seasoning. The, the seasoning. And it says the word prickly up there as yeah, well. Yeah, and so you get the, the prickliness of the yeah. hops. So and where, and where it's been double dry hopped, mm. so they're, they're adding. More, that's where they're adding more flavours, yeah. more hoppiness into yeah. it. Um, so that's but where you get that from. So there must be a lot of hops in yes. there. It's quite prickly. Well, right, not, I, think there's no, four. I don't know. There's a few. Right. Okay. We'll see. It's yeah. not like, Cheers. Looks I looks really nice. In the middle. Range. I think it's quite nice actually, it's just right for me. I think my alcohol level is up to 7%. I'll tell you what, I um, there's no sign of the 6.5% at all. No, it's, um, there's no alcohol, but really, really there is nicely a hidden. bit of bitterness in that. It is juicy. Um, but is it from the grapefruit and the fruit that's in it, or is it from the hops? Or is it a bit of both? Oh, the all the flavour. The, the, there's no for me. There's no purees in there. Right. So it's all it's all coming. From, the flavour's coming from the hops. The bitterness is coming from the hops. Yeah. That's paint. Yeah. Um, um, I'd like it to be creamier. Mm. For me, it's more it, hazy. It, no, no, just creamier. So or, or thicker, or thicker, thicker in the in the body. It's too light in body for you. It's probably a touch under for me. But, but did I'll, you drink it though? Oh fuck me! Yeah. Yeah. Do you like it? Will it go on your board, Dave? I do like that. Yeah. It is really, really nice. There is a, there is a. I'd drink it. I'd sit there. In it's nice the and ju it is juicy. Yeah. You, you're getting the, the peaches. You're getting the um, um, probably a little bit of passion I don't fruit think as well. Not a peach either. <laughs> I've had pineapple. Not a fruity person, pineapple. are you? Not in that kind of way. Pine I do there like, is pineapple I like in there. Like things like grapes, yeah. bananas, well, it's a sweeter wine. stuff. <laughs> it's a wine. It's a banana. Banana wine. Get banana beer. We get a banana beer. Oh, that'd be interesting. No, I think we've had a banana. Like, no, no, we're not. Smoothie kind. Yeah, of but we've not the proper banana beer. There was a banana it's bread not beer. Like a, oh, okay. Okay, so we'll get older. For me, that that's okay. It's, um, there's, there's a nice, there's a nice, um, a little bitterness running through that. Um, nice and tropical. A little bit of citrus as well. So um, the question is. So the question. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs down. Thumbs in the middle. It's a thumbs up for me. Oh, Wonder, up up. Up. Um, is it as good as ECAT? Right, for, for me, I don't think it is. I think ECAT is that the tops first it. New England IPA I've liked? Uh, no, you liked um, Brewdog and Cloudwater as well. Oh, yeah. And you also like the Spared No, no Expenses. Expense. We'd have to go through what you've liked, to be fair, but that'd be another video on its own. There's a few there. Yeah, um, yeah for, for me, it's probably just under ECAT, just on the body of the beer. And the and it's probably and the ECAT probably tastes a little slightly smoother as well okay. um but it's a thumbs up um tesco tesco's they've done fucking amazingly really yeah. out of a three pound a can absolutely amazing well half the time the shelves are clear 
part, like empty, yeah. where obviously it's quite popular, whatever's on there. Now, on this probably come out on Sunday. Mm -hmm. um, we've got one to do, to find, to do for Tuesday. I don't know what we're going to do. Oh, because Tuesday is the birthday of our channel. So we're a year we old on Tuesday. So, so we need a birthday cake. I had all sorts of plans for the birthday thing, but they, fell, they fell through, obviously, because and of banners. lockdown and the social distancing. And mm. I can't get hold of the things I wanted to get hold of. Or the stuff that I've tried before. Yeah, so the stuff that you really hated, stuff like. that you really hated this year, yeah. we were going to put like three or four in front of you and see if your taste buds have changed Change. enough but obviously but we'll, we'll, do, that another we'll time, do that another time we? that could be like a summer session yeah um so yeah again tesco's absolutely superb another it's a great beer it is great in, in the range um for me so find us on instagram we'll go, um <laughs> fucking lost there right got gone mad isn't it? are you okay no, 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 no. Um, yeah. oh you feel a bit hot yeah Oh, don't say that. I've got a temperature. I've got, I've got a cough. Warm today. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, try it. Comment down below if you've tried it. What do you think about it? Um, thumbs up, thumbs down. Doesn't really matter. Um, find us on Instagram, Wonder Beer Wonder. Facebook, Wonder Beer Wonder. Um, also on the um, Craft Beer UK on um, Facebook. And we'll see you next time.